The 5F AX Weapon Stabilizer is the big brother to the 3F, performing the same function as its smaller companion, but more of it. Power draw is doubled from the 3F, landing at 3 megawatts flat, making this module more demanding than most Guardian weapons. Only the size 3 Guardian Plasma Charger draws more energy, but not by much. When paired with an armored reactor and a theoretical 6 Guardian weapons, Commanders should expect power constraints to be a significant issue. These constraints can be addressed with a Guardian power plant or overcharged engineering, though at the cost of module integrity. Weight also climbs to a level that can be impactful on some medium ship builds. At 20 tons, it's a weighty beast, though not insurmountable. Large ships will hardly notice the extra junk in the trunk, so most large ships will be able to find the space and resources for it. Medium ships will have a more difficult time, but can make up for power constraints by mixing in human AX weapons. As for flight performance, the results might shock you. Six Salvation modified plasma chargers cranking away draws a lot of power. I had expected the bug smashing capability here to be something more dramatic, but unfortunately, this setup did not tip the scale into instagive territory as I had hoped. Premium Synthesis will change the game here, though keeping six plasma chargers well-fed is a tall order for most, and not something I would consider very practical. Like its little brother, the 5F stabilizer is slaved to main power and cannot be controlled by the pilot in flight. No power priority can be set, and the module cannot be uninstalled while more than four experimental weapons are mounted. The module does not appear to take any damage from hull breach attacks. Pilots choosing to equip this weapon will likely be sacrificing hull or module reinforcement, potentially losing more than 600 absolute hull integrity with engineering. Having this module equipped also has implications for power management, since its power draw will push your ship's base power load closer to the 40% mark, leaving less room for Priority 1 modules in the event of critical reactor damage and malfunctions. Make no mistake. You are trading defensive resilience for the potential of greater attacking power. More damage can be helpful, but only if you can retain the power to drive these weapons, the heat capacity to withstand them, and the capacitor depth to fire them. Regardless of these drawbacks, the 5F stabilizer is a massive improvement to the weapon ecosystem, and one I will happily recommend to any player with at least six hardpoints to fill. That's all I have for today, so I'll catch you all later.